In today's video, we're going to show you 5 more incredible Fallout 4 mods with below 10,000 downloads, but which we think definitely deserve more attention. Starting things off, we have Wolf Meat, a mod that replaces dog meat with a custom made wolf mesh. The new model looks absolutely adorable and transforms him into a super fluffy chunky boy. You can choose between three fur colours, with our personal favourite being the white one, almost like a small cuddly polar bear. It's only a visual change, so all the animations in his behaviour remain the same and work without issues. Hey boy, you know any tricks? Be aware, however, that this mesh was not intended to be used with dog armours. We adore this mod, and it's perfect for anyone who wants their canine friend a little more on the wilder side. Assisting the Minutemen can quickly become a quite tedious and monotone task. Receive a settlement quest from Preston. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. Help out mention settlement. Thanks again, friend. Return to Preston you know for the next quest. Me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. With who's the general, you can break through some of that repetition. The mod makes it so that Preston no longer gives you a new quest as part of turning in an old one. Instead, most Minutemen quests have been moved to one of his dialogue options. On top of that, you no longer need to report back to Preston all the time, and you can also help out any settlement whenever you want. Anything I can do to help? As a matter of fact, there is. This just makes more sense all around and provides more enjoyable gameplay, so there is no reason to not get this mod. Please, you've got to help me. It surprised us that Water Mines has so few downloads given that it's such a well-developed and fun mod. It allows you to craft autonomous mines that seek out their target and self-destruct upon reaching it. You equip them like regular mines and throw them as you normally would. If no target can be found, the mine will stick by your side until one is detected, and then off it goes. These come in five different variants, and they make for great tools to sneak around corners and surprise your enemies. Everything about this mod works as intended, and it's a wonderful and law-friendly addition to your explosive arsenal. If you've ever wanted to become somewhat of a superhuman in Fallout 4 and crush your foes with psychic abilities, then psychic powers might just be what you're looking for. The mod allows you to acquire 20 unique superpowers by injecting yourself with an unusual FEV serum. These act as either throwable grenades or as consumable aid items. Defend yourself with energy barriers, jump higher, teleport from one target to another, or carbonize opponents with elemental powers. The possibilities are many, and all of this comes somewhat balanced. Using powers drains your AP, and if you don't have enough will fail and cause all active effects to disrupt and damage you, possibly even infecting you with an incurable illness. The mod opens up a lot of unique ways to approach combat situations and is lots of fun to experiment with. We're impressed by how well all of this works with Fallout's limitations, and it's really worth checking out. And finally, we have Tactical Tablet. This mod isn't on the Nexus anymore, so we don't actually know how many downloads it has, but we still decided to include it, as it is our favourite Pip-Boy replacement. The tablet comes fully animated, using a touchscreen operation method as well as a slider on top. Its design is sleek and aesthetically pleasing, with a high quality model and excellent texture detail. It also frees up your left arm, which we personally much prefer. We haven't found a good download link for this mod, so we just uploaded it ourselves and put it in the description. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching.